HCF of 78 and 168. To find the HCF, we should do the prime factorization of each number separately. What I mean is, see, 78 here, 168 here. This is your step 1. Next. In this number, last digit 8, even number, so take 2. First number 7. A number close to 7 in 2 table is 2, 3, 6. 7 minus 6, 1, 1 carried forward 18. When do we get 18 in 2 table? 2 nines, 18. Now, last digit 9, not even. So, this number is not divisible by 2. Next to prime number 3. To check divisibility by 3, for that we should add the digits. 3 plus 9, we get 12. Is 12 divisible by 3? Yes. So, this number also divisible by 3. So, take 3. First number 3. When do we get 3 in 3 table? 3 1 3. The other number 9, when do we get 9 in 3 table? 3 3 is 9. Now, 13 is a prime number, so 13 1 is 13. The other number, last digit 8, even number, so take 2. First number 1, smaller than 2, so 2 numbers, 16. When do we get 16 in 2 table? 2 8 16. The other number 8, when do we get 8 in 2 table? 2 4 is 8. Now, last digit 4, even number, so take 2. First number 8, when do we get 8 in 2 table? 2 4 is 8. The other number 4, when do we get 4 in 2 table? 2 2 is 4. Last digit 2, even number, so take 2. First number 4, when do we get 4 in 2 table? 2 2 is 4. The other number 2, when do we get 2 in 2 table? 2 1 is 2. Now 21 is 3 7 is 21. 7 is a prime number, so 7 1 7. Therefore, our HCF is, HCF is the product of the numbers which should be present over here and also here. Here and here. So now let us find the numbers which should be present here and here. Starting with the number 2. Do we have 2 here? Yes. So cut 2 right here. Next number 3. Do we have 3 here? Yes. So cut 3 right here. Next number 13. Do we have 13 here? No. No more numbers have been left out. So our HCF is 2 into 3, 6 is our HCF.